All right, what's up with it, y'all? It's your boy Rock, and you see what it is. Back with another Kwame video. As you know, Kwame is stay on fire. What do you say? This quicksand around here. Quicksand, baby. Weapon born against me shall prosper. It won't work <laughs> against me. Shall prosper. Give it up for Kwame with the vocals. <laughs> <laughs> hey man, you know, we just have a little bit of fun around here, but man. So Kwame get into it, man. He talk a little bit about this, a little bit about that, especially about this whole accusations between uh, Cappy, uh, what was her name, Cappy Pondexter, and uh, that she made on LeBron James. She's saying LeBron James took her money, saying LeBron James was trafficking or trafficking people, whole bunch of wild stuff. And it's funny that all this type of stuff, she, LeBron get all these accusations, right? But it's not in the news. You know what I'm saying? Kind of weird. And, you know, that's kind of what Kwame is talking about. Why would he be getting messed with as much as he do by the go-along, get-along gang if he get all this stuff happening? They bringing up old accusations of him from back in the day. But, like people always say, I probably talk too much. I'm let, I'm let Kwame get into it. Y'all know as well, I always bring the info for y'all so y'all can really get what's really going on. You know what I'm saying? And you can come up with your own conclusion on how this whole thing playing out. Remember, quick saying and I said that these groups use women. They use a, a LGBT community. They try to pit the whole world against you. And ever since I've been arguing with the go along, get along gang, Jack tried to put me in against the whole goddamn Muslims or whatever group he down with now. I'm talking about let's play in traffic. Maddie told me, invited me to his penis. And then when I asked to beat that ass like a man, cause you don't talk like that. He want me to come to the studio to set me up for the Dulo twist. Charlemagne, the bitch ass lesser charge, put in the media that my whole family full of killers and I'm out of snap. While people playing with me behind the scenes, talking about it's going to hurt the people that's close to me and it's going to hurt my family if I keep talking. So that if I win this exchange that we meet in traffic, I'm already deemed a crazy one. I must be like my daddy. I must be like my brother that's supposedly in prison that was just sitting next to me having a drink see this go along get along gang is easy to beat you just need you motherfuckers to open your eyes and see facts and that's the reason why he he be basically telling y'all he best broke it down like that with all the stuff they doing them now watch watch this you know i'm like when talk i ain't going too far yeah because see i'm somebody that they don't like so they bring up something old about me but the person they like had a NBA, WNBA All-Star, a WNBA All-Star alleged something about him, and I'm in the news more than he's in the news right now. We're going to get into that later. We're going to get into that right now. <laughs> but you know what I'm saying? Because he goes on to the video, because if y'all don't know, if y'all haven't seen the accusations, your boy Hassan Campbell back at it, you know, doing Hassan stuff. He gonna bring up a dumb accusation on Kwame. I guess that happened back in like in 06 or 07 or 08 or something when he was in the league. Trying to say that Kwame did time for uh, doing the R word on a girl and that he paid her off. You know what I'm saying? But Kwame goes to break that down. Ain't none of that true. I was gonna do a video on that, but uh, Kwame, uh, uh, he did it on his channel and he it's already another guy that did it. So I was like, nah, I ain't gonna do that. But I did want to cover this. This whole Cappy thing, with, and her saying that uh, she said LeBron James is a, a trafficker, says she he he took thirty million from her. Matter of fact, I don't even know why I'm saying it. I'm gonna let her talk. <laughs> what well, I'm saying, I'm gonna let her say. Let's let her say her piece. I ain't confused. I ain't on that shit. That nigga tried to kill me for real. I just fucking got out of that shit. I've been missing for almost like two years. I didn't even know where the fuck I was at. I do not fuck with LeBron James. That nigga's a trafficker, my nigga. 
That nigga is a trafficker. He is a fucking trafficker. He trafficked women in real time. That nigga stole all my money out of my bank account. <laughs> it ain't no woe for me. Listen. Hey, those are some real serious accusations. And y'all already know, if these type of accusations is going on right now against Kwame, hey, he be all over the news right now. I mean, but look, Cappy keep going, though. That, that ain't even it. And give back as wonderfully as I have. I touch more kids than you have. You and LeBron put together. That I promised school he was molesting them kids. I'm going to talk about it. I don't care. Y'all can't kill me. I'm immortal. A two-year-old, and he worth every fucking penny of it because when y'all find out who he is in real time and who his sister helps run it, oh, my God. You're going to be like, oh, it's a no-brainer, man. He's already, you know, who he is. You're going to want to support it even more. Yeah, I live in L.A., so what? I'm, I've been living in L.A. since I was two years old. I was taken and moved to Chicago. I sure don't fuck with you. I told you Sam is nips, nigga. And that's the part right there where I'm still kind of up in the air with trying to wrap my head. She been missing for two years? So, you know, your boy Rock, I go and look this up. Right here, bam. Former NBA player Cappy Pondas located after being reported missing. And for what she just said, she was missing for two years. You know what I'm saying? And it, I went through this, and it, it, it's real vague. It just say that they found her, and she wanted her fans to support her. I mean, that's some, that's some weird stuff, you know what I'm saying? And then I was listening. So y'all know me. I listen. I do a little bit of conspiracy theory, theories myself, you know what I'm saying? I'm more like, what what y'all think going on? Now, the cold part. Her videos, these two, she sound 100% official. You know what I'm saying? And give back as wonderfully as I have. I touch more kids than you have. She, she sound like she, she, you know, she in her right mind. She could, but when she went missing, something happened. My bad. It looked like my, my mic is going to lie when I, when I talk loud. So I'm going to try to keep it. But some, some happened when she went missing. You know what I'm saying? And, uh, I don't know. It just seemed kind of weird. And then I, once she, she said one thing and I was looking at her career and it says she was in Chicago. And he, she said they, they put her in Chicago or took her. It, the, the wording was weird. You know what I'm saying? But let me know. What y'all think in the comments about this one? Like, we got to talk about this. And y'all know me. Y'all do the conspiracy theories. Y'all think this MK Ultra? Something weird along those lines? And then why this not in the media? That, uh, the Kwame Wright, that's, listen, that's how you know it's a real go-along, get-along gang. If she, she ain't even in the news about this. These some real, and it's not like this is accusations from some random chick out there. This is a, a, a WNBA star, like she was an all star, like not just an NBA, WNBA player, she was an all star. Supposedly, she was up there with uh Tarasi and all them, them girls, probably damn near better. I mean, I'm looking at the stats, I mean, the stat line, it's a cold stat line. I, this, this one right here caught my eye 43% from three, 20. Let's start getting in the hoop, man. I like hoop, man, but it, it's just crazy, though. That, it's crazy, and then so you go. Through it, y'all, like I already told y'all, y'all know Twitter. Twitter got all the receipts. And you go through here. Oh, and this dude, my dog right here that speaks nothing but facts. It's, it's a big club, and you ain't in it. <laughs> it's, it's, uh, that's a fact. So right here, this don't make her look like she got these videos like this. Like, I'm, I'm not going to play the whole thing. She don't even say that. She just sitting there looking crazy. So the whole time, this... Whole 33 seconds, she just staring off into space. And then, you know, so I go look at her, her Instagram, and she got all these pictures of Beyonce up there and stuff. And check this one out. Look, peep this. Happy anniversary, my one and only queen. Congrats on two years with the gift. What gift? On two years. Remember, she said she got hit two years ago. That's what, this whole thing is funny. That's what, let me know what y'all think. I do a little bit of conspiracy theories myself. MK Ultra, what y'all think? I don't know. I don't know. I will handle LeBron and Jeff Bezos. Whoa! You didn't deserve the treatment for 38 years of me sleeping in real time. I'm glad. 
I'm glad I'm woke and you're waking up. The world will know a beautiful love story soon. What? What? Tell me that ain't nuts. You know what I'm saying? So, listen, some, some, something was going on, man. It, that's one thing I like about the internet is you can go back through and kind of see, like, what's happening. You know, you kind of put pieces together. Let me know what y'all think in the comments. I mean, some people say, and this cold part, her name is Cappy because everybody's saying she Cappin'. You know what I'm saying? Cappin' Cappy. And then, so we're going to go here, and this is the one that basically make her look, in my opinion, this is where all your allegations get thrown out the window when you make a video like this. So, y'all listen to this. Ooh, I'm richer than that nigga. See? Hold on. Remember she said he took all her money, and now look what she talking about. Hey, Julia Suave Escobar. Hold on, I was trying to find a piece where Kwame was talking about that. People like her, like, I don't know if this is real or not, but if you're making these accusations and they not real, you need to get some need that, like, if you if if I got accused of the R word by a girl at my job and they find out I didn't do it, she should go do the same time I was about to get for doing the R word to her, Right. So that's what she not looking good with this type of video. You know what I'm saying? I'm pretty sure LeBron people probably gonna come after her if, if she really defaming his character. You know what I'm saying? But it is funny, just like Kwame said, ain't none of this in the news. And then she talking all this stuff, and some of the timelines add up, which is weird. That's weird. Man, he's gonna go say, see Miss T. I'm gonna tell y'all the truth. I'm richer than that nigga. He stole 30 million from me, my nigga. I'm richer than LeBron James. Don't let that nigga fool you. Nike is my company for real. I'm tired of you motherfuckers. I've been humble my whole motherfucking life, man. Since y'all found out that I was Cappy Marie Pondex. Is that who? Fuck you niggas, man. That's really my motherfucking wife. I swear to God, y'all finna pay for this shit. I'm sending all y'all niggas over here. I'm finna let this shit be like this to this motherfucker die. For real. Fuck y'all niggas. I told y'all I wanted to see happy anniversary. Fuck y'all. What I was talking about right there. You put a video up like this, and that one where she stared off into space. All your accusations start looking crazy. You know what I'm saying? And I know it's people like like similar to me out there. That's why I'm, a lot of y'all fuck with me. A lot of y'all fuck with me for real. Uh, is this MK Ultra? What y'all think? You know what I'm saying? We we need to cover all bases. You know what I'm saying? Listen, I like to look at both sides of the coin to see what's going on. Uh, but this is this is serious, and like she's a WNBA star. And you don't see this on ESPN. You don't see this nowhere. Ain't, ain't nobody talking about this. It took Kwame to bring it up to really bring some type of light to it. You know what I'm saying? Hopefully this video really get out. Hopefully they don't shadow ban it. I don't know if y'all been peeping my channel. I mean, I, maybe it's my uh, content. I don't know. But uh seems like they, they trying to hit me with the shadow ban a little more. So, But we going to keep trucking, man, for all the real ones that been here. And for the real ones that... Uh, listen, if you made it this far... Because the video pretty much over. But if you made it this far, man, just type in MK. And that's not even if you believe it's MK. I just want to see if anybody made it to any And if, Just type MK for your boy, man. You know, it does help, help the algorithm and uh, help this get out more. Obviously, like the video if you like the video. Man, let me know what y'all think in the comments. Because this is crazy, though. I, was, I don't know, man. I don't know. She got all these weird... Yeah, it's... 
It's crazy that she went missing two years ago. LeBron, she blaming LeBron. LeBron came to the Lakers in 2018. Ah, man. Let me know what y'all think, man. It's been your boy, Rock. I will catch y'all on the next video. I ain't going to draw this out too much longer. It's crazy.